a one week vacation, so that was kind of a good thing, just to be just to be away for a week. Um, now, um, now I just saw this come through my phone, and I used to watch the show all the time. It was called Pawn Stars. Um, now the the one guy that used to run um, used to run the show was um, Richard Harris Harrison with his son Rick. And it has been confirmed that Richard Harrison, who was the father, which they always teased him by calling him old man, has died. He was 77. Um, and I didn't know he had it, but they said he suffered from Parkinson's disease. And it was a very successful show, and people used to always ask me, well, why do you watch Pawn Stars? And I said, because you could, I said, they used to get a lot of interesting shit um, on the show. But, um, and there have been some stuff that was sold to them that was fake and wasn't real. Like one of the things that um that I know that I knew was totally fake was when this guy came in and he tried to claim that Shoeless Joe had signed his book. Now the problem was Shoeless Joe didn't know how to read or write so it would so it wouldn't have been authentic for one. Um and but this guy tried to sell it and Rick and Rick wanted to believe that Shoeless Joe had wrote this. And, and then, of course, he had it appraised and found out that it was a fake signature and not a real one, as he was hoping for. Um, so, um, so eventually he would lose out on whatever money that was given um, to him, that him he gave it to. Um, that's the thing about that's the thing about their show was that they used to always try to um, set a certain price for a certain thing, and he would only give them so much for a certain thing that was brought in if it was real, and. It was either it was either you go higher or you go low on it, and that was what it was with him. But it was an awesome thing.